Okay, so it is Sunday here in Oravi and all of Japan. It's one time zone, um, apparently. Um, so I think my voice sounds really weird in these videos. I don't know, do I always sound like this? And I just don't know it. And I make a lot of weird faces. Do I usually do that? Or am I just being like performance weird? I don't know. Um, so you should let me know. Um, I straightened my hair today. See? That's why it's all straight. Because it's not as hot today. I think I s told people who I called this morning that it was really hot, but that was a lie. It's not. It's just really hot in the apartment, and I don't know why. Like, not my room, but out in the hallway, it's so hot. But it's kind of cold outside, so I don't know. Um, maybe something is going to explode. That would not be fun. But then at least, um, you know, I'd have some stories to bring back, because right now, not that much has happened. Um, I walked around town. There are a whole bunch of pictures up on Facebook, which you can access via my blog. I put the address there, um, which you should do at least, um, well, I guess I post it on my blog too, but the pictures of that statue of the kid in front of the school, I thought was really pretty. Um, yeah, so you should check that out. Um, yeah, I also have a phone number, um, for my Skype. It's on the blog and I can't remember it. I forgot to pull it up. Um, it's a 206 number though, so it's local for Seattle. Um, so you can call me there. I'm going to cover up my ears because I don't have earrings on. Um, I have a million mosquito bites. Like, six now. Um, so I should try to find some mosquito repellent. Although I talked to Stephanie Moisa on Facebook who pretty much none of you know, so I probably shouldn't have even mentioned it. Um, I had to sign Slumpyad with her, so mom, you might know who she is. Um, you spoke with her mother, she's from Mexico. Um, and Stephanie says that mosquito repellent brings more mosquitoes. If you're like a blood type that mosquitoes really like. So if you have any advice on what to do about this mosquito problem, you should tell me. because. There are a lot of bites on me. Um, I'd show you them, but they're on my leg and I'm wearing jeans today. I took a picture, and it's on both legs now. Hmm. At least my rash is going away from the necklace. So there are some weird things, but by weird, which is not PC at all, I mean things that I think are distinguish Japan from the United States, that's PC. Um, I have to sort the garbage. I'll take a picture of the garbage sorting room. It's crazy. Like, there's so many different things to sort. There's like a place for batteries, for clothing, for burnable and non-burnable, and cans and bottles. It's like all separated. It's this whole shack full of different places. And you have to put it all in bags. But I'm running out of bags, so I have to actually go get some garbage bags. So I have to figure out how to say that in Japanese. I probably can just say, like, literally garbage bags, but it might be a special word. Also, um, what else? I was going to say something. Oh, this slipper situation is weird. And by weird, I mean not the same as the United States. Um, it's just really hard to remember everything. Because you have to have different slippers for the bathroom, like where the toilet is, and different slippers for the shower, and different slippers for the rest of the building. But you can't wear shoes at all in the building after, except for like the entryway. And you have to take it off there and store your locker, or your shoes in a locker. So that's where my shoes are. Hmm. Except for I studied Japanese hazing, and if someone really doesn't like me, they're going to steal my shoes. So I hope that doesn't happen. You're also supposed to leave your umbrella outside, but I haven't been doing that. I've just been putting it in my purse so they think that I leave it outside, but I don't. Because I don't want it to get stolen. I only have one umbrella. It's not very good. I thought it was okay, but it's really, really hard to fold up all the way. Yeah, this is a long vlog. I don't know what else to talk about, though. Um, I'm reading Toni Morrison's Beloved, and it's really depressing, and I'm kind of lonely. So, I need to read a different book. I'm probably going to reread There's a Girl, or There's a Boy in the Girl's Restroom. 
There's a girl in the there's a boy in the girl's bathroom, is what it's called by Lewis Zacker. He also wrote Holes, which was a Newbery Award winner and very popular. Um, if you haven't read There's a Boy in the Girl's Bathroom, you should, because it's my favorite book and it's really funny. Yep. Um so I should probably go because I'm really hungry. I'll see you later, and I'm going to Shinjuku today, so I'll take pictures, because it's like the New York Times Square of Tokyo. I have a really big gap between my teeth. Sorry. I need to wear my retainer more. That's about all I have to say. Um, so, yeah, check out those pics or something. Mm. Talk to you later. Bye.